Hello children, you have learnt three lessons. Parts of our body, our sense organs and their functions of different parts of our body. Now, today we are going to learn something different. That is the similarities and the differences. What you will be learning from the parts of our body. That is chapter 4. Children, we live in the huge society where n number of people live together. These people have all the bodies similar, but the differences in their color, shape and their height and weight. So this we are going to learn in this chapter that is similarities and the differences. Children, we all have same parts of our body and their functions are also same. For example, we see with our eyes, we hear with our ears, we smell with our nose, we speak with our mouth, we work with our hands and we walk with our legs. So this all the parts are same to everyone and their functions are also same. But their size, shape and their growth varies from one another. So this will we will be learning more about this in the next slide with the picture. Here children we are going to learn about the skin color. We all have skin but it varies from one another. Some have dark skin, some have fair skin, some have rough skin, some have oily skin. So there are different types of skin. It varies from one another. Like skin, we also have different types of hair. At the same time, its colors also varies from one another. Some have brown hair, some have long hair, some have thick hair, some have white hair, some are bushy, some are thin. So, this color also varies from one another. The growth of hair also varies from one another. Children, we learned about different types of skin and different colored skin. And also we learned about the different types of hair and their different colors. It all, both it varies from one another. Same way, the height and the weight also differs from one another. That is called as growth of a body. Every body differs from one another. Some may be tall, some may be short, some may be fat, some may be thin. It also varies. The body also varies from one another. Children all have nose and face. All are similar to everyone. But the nose and the face differs from one another. Some may be having the pointed nose. Some may be having flat nose. Some may be having round nose. At the same time, the face also differs from one another. That is a round, oval, square and etc. From the face, you can identify who they are. When you look to a person, you can identify with the shape and color. The same way, you can also identify a person with their eyes. Eyes also varies from one another. Some may be having black eyes, some may be having blue eyes and some may be having brown eyes. This varies from one person to another. That is the difference in the eyes. In this lesson, we learned about the different types and the shapes of faces. We learned about the different types of hairs and the color. We also learned about the skin and their color. We also learned about the height and weight. It all varies from one another. Now, children, take out your EBS notebook and draw, copy down all the notes. The first is name the following. What are the different types of faces? There is the oval and round. They are different skin color. They are fair and dark. Hair color, brown and black. Height of your person, tall and short. Weight of your person, fat and thin. All this you copy down in your notebook. Children, you have to make three columns. That is, match the following. A side and B side. 
A side is the all the questions and B side the answers are jumbled. You have to match and write the answers in the answer column. That is A versus B with the answer column. The first one is the nose. How is the nose? The nose is flat. So in the first column you have to write the answer sheet. You have to write the flat nose. Hair color, hair, how it is? It is a curly hair. The second answer is curly. The third one, eye. How is the eye? Blue color. So third one answer is blue. And similar, what is similar? Means same, similar means same. Everybody is having same thing. That is the fingers. Fingers are same for all. So the fourth one is fingers. And the different, we have the different size. We have different shapes. So here the size is different. The fifth is size. So all these you have to write, copy down the A column, answer column and the B column in your notebook.